Hey, what's up guys? I wanted to share with you uh, part one of my bench build. I just finished doing the whole top here. This video has been a long time in making. Uh, I probably started making this bench about 10 months ago. Um, just haven't gotten around to it and thinking about how I wanted to do it more so than actually building it. Um, and also it just takes a lot, of, a lot of time to build up the boards and, and lay it all out. Just thinking about the vise here it took me a while, but I'm glad I'm to this point. I'm just about ready to do the, the legs, which I'm going to put in with some rising dovetails, um, do the leg vise, and then run some stretchers. And hopefully do some cool joinery with those as well. I put a wagon vise into the top of my vise. I didn't use any special hardware. I just got a, a vise screw, a Jorgensen vise screw, one and a quarter inch. Uh, I used that and kind of made it myself. Uh, I think it turned out all right, um, but I did splurge on getting some bench crafted hardware for my leg vise, which I did an unboxing of, if you haven't seen already. Um, but yeah, I wanted to put together a little video here, show you how I made it, and uh, let's roll it. into as I was putting this section here with the uh, the wagon vise in it. Um, I didn't want to, I just glued these up here, these three sections here. I didn't want to glue it all together because I didn't feel like I could get it all squared up with the dovetails. So I decided to do kind of the dovetail separate. I'd glue these up and then once I glued these up, got this all squared up, I'd be able to um, glue it to this piece then. Before I glued this section up right here, I measured out um, the distance I wanted this to be. So I had my, um, my block, put that in there. I have this piece here to hold on to my uh, screw, and then that's coming out right here. Um, I didn't um, uh, drill this hole yet for the screw to come through the face block there so I want to make sure I have that all mocked up and square. I left about a quarter of an inch when it's all the way in to have a, a little bezel out here um, to kind of dress that up. And then um, this piece right here will be recessed inside this piece right below, right below there to kind of accept the screw. So that's kind of how hopefully that will all work out. 
the other thing I debated was whether I wanted this to be a removable um, block for my wagon vise. Um, I wasn't sure the best way to be able to do that. I really don't want to put a whole bunch of bolts and screws everywhere and be able to take it all apart. I kind of want it to be mostly wood. Um, so at this point I'm ending up just once it's in it's going to stay in it's not going to come out. Um, if it does crack or anything I'll be able to chisel it out from below and then kind of make make things work from then. But, um, but for now I decided it would be best just to not worry about it and just make it a non-removable sliding block.
in the uh, wag. I put in a vice. Whoa. I put in a wagon vice.